Hello everyone, you are welcome back to Shabes Online Tutorial. In today's tutorial, we are going to learn how to simplify this sodic expression. And the given expression is what? Root of 3 over 2 minus root of 2 over 3. To simplify this, the first thing we are going to do, we can rewrite this as what? Root of 3 divided by root of 2 minus root of 2 divided by root of 3. So they can share the square root according to one of the property of sod. Now, the next thing we are going to do is to simplify. We are going to find the LUCM of the denominator and sort 2 and sort 3. And there is no common factor in sort 2 and sort 3. That means we are going to multiply them together. Our answer is going to be the LUCM. Sort 2 multiplied by sort 3 is going to give us what sort 6. Then we rule a division line. Now we are going to divide. Sort 6 divided by sort 2 is going to give us sort 3. Then sort 3 multiplied by sort 3 is going to give us sort 3 square. Then minus sort 6 divided by sort 3 is going to give us sort 2. Then sort 2 multiplied by sort 2 is the same as sort 2 raised to the power of 2. Now this is going to be the same as this square is going to cancel the square root. We are left with 3 minus also the square will cancel the square root to be 2. Then everything all over sort 6. So this is going to be the same as 3 minus 2 is going to give us 1 all over sort 6. We are not going to stop at here. We are going to rationalize this expression. Rationalization meaning we are going to use this sort 6 in the denominator to multiply this expression by what? Sort 6 over sort 6. So this is going to be the same as multiply by sort 6 over sort 6. We know, we know if we divide sort 6 by sort 6, it's going to be 1. Then 1 multiplied by this expression is still the same. Nothing changed. Like this is multiplication of fraction. We can multiply the numerator, then divide it by we multiply the denominator. This is going to be the same as 1 multiplied by sub 6 is going to give us sub 6 divided by sub 6 multiplied by sub 6 is going to give us sub 36. So this is going to be the same as what? Sub 6 divided by, you know, 36 is the perfect square. And if you take the square root of 36, it's going to be for 6. And here is the simplification of this sodic expression. Thank you for watching and please follow and subscribe for more videos like this. Thanks.